Magandang umaga po mga Ka-Agri TV. Ito po si Mike Hernandez ng Koi Keeping. First quarter of the year na naman po, ibig sabihin malamig po ang panahon. At kung malamig po ang panahon, ito po ang pinaka-ideal time kung kaya nangyayari yung maraming mga Koi Shows sa loob at labas ng Pilipinas. At isa po dito ang ating masasaksihan na 2017 Philippine Koi Show. Sa harap po natin, nandito po ang ating koi vat na tinatawag. Ito po yung kung saan nilalagay ang mga koi na isasali po sa koi show. Dito po sa bandel ni Kurampa natin ay ang splash guard. Ito po ang nagiging partition in between koi vats para po yung mga tubig ng uh, one koi vat to the other hindi po magi splash to prevent sickness and contamination. Bayaan po ninyong dalihin ko kayo sa ating... Uh, most recently concluded 2016 Philippine Koi Show nung nakaraang taon para naman po makita ninyo kung anong gagawin natin this coming 2017 Philippine Koi Show. Panoorin po natin to. During benching po ang mga koi entries ay kinikilatis ng mga show benchers headed by the show chairman na kung ang mga ilalok na koi ay healthy. Matapos pong kilatisin ang mga koi entry, ito naman po ay sinusukat kung saan ang koi ay maglalan sa kanilang proper sizes. The benching team will now classify the koi to its corresponding variety which might be under Kohaku, Sanke, Showa, and etc. During benching, the koi is photographed, sized, variety categorized, and put into documentation forms for the judge's reference during judgment day. In the case of the 2016 Philippine Koi Show, nagkaroon po tayo ng mahigit 300 koi entries which were placed in 60 koi show vats. We had foreign Shinkokai member judges from Japan and the US to judge our koi show who are mainly koi breeders and dealers. Kagaya po ng nabanggit ko sa nakaraan nating episode, the first object of the day is to look for the grand champion, which is done by votation. After the grand champion has been chosen, the judges are divided into two teams and are given division and size to judge. The 10 member judges of the Philippine Koi Judges Association paid shadow judges to the official foreign Koi judges in their capacity as candidate judges in training. Having been one of the judges on several occasions of the All Japan Shinkokai Show in Tokyo and various Koi shows across the United States, in my opinion, looking at these living jewels entered in the 2016 Philippine Koi Show Judging, as always, is painfully precise. Nakita na po ninyo ang mga nangyari during benching and judging sa 2016 Philippine Koi Show. Sa susunod pong episode, let me show you the reigning winners of the 2016 Philippine Koi Show. Pero bago po muna yan, ay bayaan pong imbitahan po kayo sa darating po nating Koi Show, which is the 2017 Philippine Koi Show. This will be held here in Koi Sen Pants, February 11 and 12. So, masaya po ito. Kinukumbidahan ko po kayong lahat. This is Mike Hernandez ng Koi Keeping saying heaven is when you finally able to decipher the finer decision ng Agri TV. Hayop ang galing.